so this is our app uh, the react app the front end basically so it is running on 3000 port number now what we'll be doing is uh, we'll be working on our front end a little bit so i can go inside the client directory and you can see we have this src folder and first of all i'll be removing everything from it and you can also remove uh, the other files which you don't need uh, such as this logo.svg which is the react logo you can delete it yeah i want it to be deleted also the styling which is available in here you can remove it now in this i can create a simple rfce so basically in this first of all i'll be adding the react router to it so to add a react router i'll be going inside the client directory and installing react router npm install react router and react router dom because we want uh, our app to be in multiple pages right we need login screen the landing screen or the home screen and the register screen as well as the to-do list screen right so that will be uh, creating in this video react router dom so uh, react router and we install react router and react router dom after this is installed what we can do is uh, we can wrap everything inside a browser router browser router oh i think that will make sense if we do it outside this route so i can import routes and inside that we have different pages we have to create so i can create a folder called pages or you can name it simply pages inside that you can specify the landing screen the landing.jsx uh yeah i think that would make sense if we make it in a folder landing and we can move it to this yeah i want it to be moved yeah now rfce for this so this rfce is done with the help of a package called react snippet or react react es6 snippets that you can install with the help of extensions which is available in vs code so this is it or you can simply write a simple functional component in uh, this page i can also create a separate page for let's say auth and inside that i'll be creating a register screen register.jsx i'll be creating rfce so i'll be creating a simple uh, demo pages for now later we'll be designing all these pages separately i'll be creating login.jsx rfce okay also so one two three and then we have a to do page basically so to do inside that i'll be creating a to do list dot jsx i can write rfce here that will work and i can go inside the routes and i can import it now because our packages are installed i can import routes from react router and then i can specify uh, the path route in that i have to specify the path which is home page uh, basically i can wrap it like this and i can specify the element for home page so i can specify the element as a uh, landing so that will be imported here i can also import it react router 
from react auto you can import it and after that we have four routes i think one is the login route uh, the other one is the register route the fourth one is to do list and uh, for the login i can import the login route or the login page which we created in the auth folder we have the register page we have it then we also have the to do list page now everything is done now if i go to the browser it should show me uh, the landing screen okay oh i forgot one more thing that i haven't wrapped my app in a browser router that i forgot a very big mistake that i have did browser router this is very important because these routes comes under this router so this you can install import from i think it will be browser router from react router dom so that will work okay perfect now you can see we have this landing screen if i go to login screen so i can see the login page if i go to the register page so it will be there if i go to to do list it will also be available so all the pages are working fine and in the next video we'll be working on the landing screen page or the landing page we'll be adding some styling for the landing page and then we'll be doing that for all the other pages as well so this is it for this video i hope you got something thank you for watching let's meet in the next video